Awaken, demon. Your wounds have been attended to. What is this? Who are you? Now, now, Illidan. Do not disappoint me any further. This is impossible. Ashara. It seems your wounds did not entirely destroy your senses. But how? You always thought you were one step ahead, didn't you? So convinced in your plans for the well of eternity and combating your brother. Truth be told, you were never ahead of anything. Not even the Naga you thought of as your servants. They were always mine, acting on my orders. Then why didn't you order them to kill me? Because you served as the perfect pawn. My Naga used you to spy on the condition of this land. While you were occupied, my spies informed me of everything to ensure my return is unexpected. So you kept me alive just so you could mock me, just like him. I have asked you not to disappoint me any further. What are you talking about? You've betrayed me once, Illidan, and now it is time for you to make up for it. You will continue to be my pawn. I may have underestimated Furion, but I will not stoop myself so low to become one of your pawns. Do you despise me so much, demon? You can kill me now, Sea Witch. You're the queen of a sunken empire. Such colorful insults, Illidan. But I can assure you that you will do my bidding. Begin, my servants. What are you doing? No. Have you more harsh words for me, demon? Or will you play nicely? I would much prefer the latter. This can't be. And here I was, complimenting your senses. Who did this? I think we both know Illidan. His stench was all over the temple when my Naga entered the place. Tyrande, my love. I will kill him! But you have failed already. You cannot defeat him, as his powers grow stronger by the minute. Then I will find a way. I know what he is now. Can you, demon? Your brother acquires more allies with each passing day. What army do you have now with your highborn gone? Whether you like it or not, you need my powers to defeat your brother. That thing is not my brother. Face it then, Illidan, or perish again, alone. I submit to you, my queen. I am yours to command. At that same moment, Faradrella makes her way towards a newly established Cenarian base. You summoned me, Dad? What did I do wrong? Did I fail again? How is the restoration going? Oh yes, of course. The earthquake didn't damage our forests, but I can't say the same about the land around Hyjal. I was told the place is a disaster now. Is it true Shando did all that? I have told you many times to be more cautious, even when around your own people. You must always be two steps ahead if you are to lead the Cenarian Circle. You were lucky to have escaped Furion on your last encounter. It wasn't luck, it was skill. Get back to your chores, Faradrella. Oh man! Despite her attitude, your daughter is a promising individual who is undeterred by what others think of her. We have been collecting the runes you've requested, but it will take us some time before we can assemble the pieces together. That is to be expected, as the ritual will not be easy to perform. What did you discover at Mount Hyjal? 
Your apprentice has destroyed the Guardians, as well as the entire land in his quest to stop the Legion. I spoke to him in the Eternal Dream. The conflict within you will only cloud your judgment. He must be stopped at all costs before he leads this world to ruin. How could this happen? Can the powers of corruption break the will of my people so easily? Furion was the most powerful of them all, both in mind and body. Now he's destroying the very society he swore to protect. I grieve for your loss, Cenarius. But the moment you doubt yourself is the point where you lose everything. What has happened is a result of his actions, not yours. The corruption that spreads throughout Malfurion's body did nothing more than amplify his fears. The Legion's terrors must have polluted his thoughts, disrupting the link between him and the Emerald Dream and awaken him from his slumber. It is unfortunate that Shando did not have the will to resist the corruption. Now, he is as large of a threat as Kil'jaeden, and both their forces cannot reach Nordrassil. We do not have the manpower to defend Nordrassil against two invading armies. Both the Sentinels and Guardians' forces have been annihilated. Once the ritual begins, we'll gain the strength to repel those who approach Nordrassil. Dispatch your followers throughout the land, as the entire realm must be cleansed if we're to perform the ritual safely. My daughter and her company are already handling that. Clear your mind of any doubts you might have. It's inevitable that you will face Stormrage, and you must prevail. He will come, that is certain. <laughs>